Good morning, beautiful beings. Happy Friday. It is currently 7.22. And I am on my way. First of all, pause. I am tired. But I told myself yesterday I was going to treat myself to breakfast because yesterday was officially my two-year anniversary of being seizure-free. I don't know. It's crazy. I'll, like, have more... Of, uh, I'll explain more rather I'll explain more a bit later um, I w I'm not gonna go like too into depth but just briefly cover the basics of it so the spot that we're going to is my favorite spot which is birds it's more of a mom and pop breakfast brunch type place and they close it too they close at 2 p.m. and <clears throat> it's a very popular place. And even though it's Friday and I'm off, it would definitely be packed this morning with people who are already off of work or anything like that. So I had just got myself together. <clears throat> I got dressed, but nine times out of ten, I would definitely be throwing my pajamas back on when I get back in the house. Just grabbing everything I need and I'm heading out. Let's see if I be talking. All right, so I'm back home. It is currently. 916 so it's pretty much in and out I was going to take my camera but it was early morning I mean what I mean by that is it was an older crowd I didn't want anybody to feel awkward so I didn't take my camera in but I did bring my leftovers home so just a quick glance of the leftovers I'll definitely be eating that when I get up from my nap because I am about to change back into my PJs and relax. But I just want to touch basis on the title of this video. So as of yesterday, I was officially two years seizure free. It's crazy because I did not have any seizures at all. I turned 28 and my body hit my function mode and it was rough. I'm not even going to sit here and lie. Between the random blackouts, waking up in back of an ambulance, not knowing what was going on for almost about a year and a half. Um, and then finally the medication got right. So here I am today, two years season free. Still a bit of sweet moment because yesterday was also the two year mark of my grandmother passing. But um, thriving on all ends, I definitely wanted to give up so many times, but I didn't. And that was also a part of the reason why I just finally put my foot down and, you know, went after my goals of this being here, content creation. So, yeah. So, I'm here better than ever. And I've been listening to my body a lot more because I was like so go, go, go back then, especially with fitness. I also forgot to mention that I was putting myself on the back burner putting everybody else before me and not really taking care of myself at that point in period it was during COVID and there was a lot that was just happening in general and then all of that started and I've been like listening like I said to my body and not beating myself up about it because I got home yesterday and I was just like I'm tired <laughs> that was one of the main signs you know that I noticed I didn't notice then that I know now so I'm just giving myself grace and I beat myself up about anything that you know when it comes to like fitness and everything like that although I do have goals to reach I also have to keep and be mindful of my situation and we don't want to start over because every time I had a relapse it was literally like starting over from the beginning so that was that <laughs> probably was all over the place but I'm literally about to switch back into my pajamas, lay back down. I'll probably fall back asleep, but when I come back, I'm going to do my TikTok haul. Happy Saturday. I'm not even going to sit here and lie to y'all. I literally slept off and on all day yesterday. Do I regret it? No, because obviously I needed to rest. 
but I did plan on doing this yesterday. So I'm here to bring TikTok shop, TikTok shop haul. Things I bought off of TikTok. Y'all, those TikTok advertisements be getting me. First package, I don't know what like exactly is in each package. So, first package I have, oh this is the hair oil. I have seen people talking about hair oils. It is the Voodoo Hair Growth Oil. And I have what, two bottles of those. This is the other one. Hopefully it's worth it. I have two bottles of those. Then this one is, let's see, let's see, let's see. So I have been looking for nail gel. Not, I'm sorry. I have been looking for nail glue. Because after, I told you guys a, a while back when I ordered the BTR box, nail glue they didn't have anymore. Like when I went back, it was completely wiped off of Amazon. So I had did some research and I had been looking up there and I found this Lux nail glue that people have been raving about. So I bought two of those. So I'm gonna try these out tomorrow. I had, I had actually ordered a new set of French tips from Amazon. So we're gonna try that out. I'm gonna try to go out tomorrow with those. It's cute, they have a little card in there. And then you can win some free nails. Cute little packaging. This is, it's one of those books I ordered, I know. Okay, so this one is the Miracle Journal. Y'all know I'm all about manifesting, praying. And I saw that book, and then I also saw this book. This is my other book. Obviously, I know what this one is because I have that one. I ordered two of these books as well. And these two journals are the 369 Method journals. I also wanted to give these a try to see how these will work. I'm excited. I am really excited. So I actually like came up with my own method to manifestation and journaling, but she promotes her book like with passion, with such security, and it's like she knows what she's doing. And I really wanted to try this out. And then with this one, I also seen people just talking about it a lot, promoting it, and I figured why not also give this one a try. So I have bought two of these ones. Learn more about the 369 method and to start actually getting my stuff written down and seeing it come to flourishing. I'm gonna start both of these tomorrow. So what I'm planning on doing is I need to get back on my old schedule of getting up at like four 15 was the earliest I was getting up, 4.45 the latest, uh, most mornings. But I need to get back on track because I want to be able to get up, you know, um, do yoga, meditate, and then pop these two out, journal in these in the morning. I'll take this one with me because, with me because you do this one three times a day. So I'll take it with me and do it for lunch. Bring it back home, of course, and then I'll do it for, before I go to bed. We'll see how that works. But anyway, that was everything that I got off of TikTok shop. So it is 9.49 and I'm warming my leftovers up from yesterday for breakfast. Jackson was supposed to have a soccer game today, but I don't think he's gonna have one because the weather. It's like off and on raining. I'm gonna eat breakfast, kick back. I didn't even know, well, I know now, but I didn't know that Coachella was the past weekend and this weekend is Second half of Coachella, so I'm gonna be catching up on people. Coachella, Coachella. I'm gonna be catching up on Coachella vlogs. Manifesting it. I will be there next year. Next year or two. Y'all, I'm, I'm, I'm serious, I'm going hard. I want my channel to grow. I appreciate the supporters that I have now, but I'm just ready for growth in all areas of life. And it's a golden line. Thank you.
Let's show your magic, Millie. <laughs> look, look, look. They <laughs> get with each other all the time. Mm -hmm. He said twins. No, no, look, look. There he goes. He didn't found his rear. Oh. Look, look, look. Get up. Get up. <laughs> Look at Jackson. <laughs> Go get the ball, Jackson. Oh, they family. They get it, Jackson. Go get it. Oh, get, it. Go get, it. get it, Jack. Go. See, so Jackson will come. 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 Jackson will Get up, Jack! No, no, no. Stand there talking to the cousin. Oh! At this point? They're my nieces right there. They're not this one. They'll be all right. <laughs> no, he mad because he's supposed to go. Get it, Jack. Get it, Jack. Get it, Jack. Get it, Jack. Good job. 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 Now you ready to go home? You got a bag? Wow. You ain't got nothing in here. Get out his bag. <laughs> the bathroom. Good job, Tiger. Is that it? You got it? Hello, hey, Papa. Move! You were not going to do this yet. Anyways, it's me. You are the real queen. You are not the real queen. It's me, you know that? Oh. Anyways, y'all, excuse me for this urban. What is this, Queen? Hey, <laughs> oh, ooh, ooh. You pausing? Uh, uh, let me see. Hey. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, get it. I'm gonna get that footage edited because I want to post it on Facebook so all of our family can see. I'm getting ready to put me some pizza rolls in the oven and then I need to take something for my back because when I had woke up earlier, I slept in the wrong position or something. <clears throat> my back was already hurting and now it's hurting more. So I want to eat and take something all right, so I'm up and at them on this rainy Sunday. <laughs> We're getting ready to head out to the grocery store to get everything that I need for the week ahead. And I was also working on, uh, which one was I working on? I was working on the manifestation journal. I didn't realize it was a lot of prep work before actually getting into the nitty gritty, but I like that. It's asking a lot of questions that I could really use and about people who inspire you and things. So I'm excited. Okay, this is a quick glance. I'm going to go over everything that I got at my Walmart haul. So, I was trying to change up the chips this week. So, I picked up these baked variety chips. And then I also picked up these Simply White Cheddar Cheese Puffs. I also picked up some Honey Roasted Pistachios. I have some cheese. I want to do sandwiches for lunch. And we already have cheese. These were on sale. So, I picked up these just for something when I need something really sweet. I got two boxes of those. Star Crunch. Then I also picked up a bag of pineapple chunks, mango chunks. For dinner, what I want to do is I picked up another bag of that chicken. So I'm going to grill the chicken. I'm going to do broccoli this time around with a cup of rice. Also picked up some toasted strudels. Some waffles for the morning. I'm having this with some honey roasted peanut butter. And then if I'm like <laughs> slowly but surely moving around, I also picked up some cups of cereal. I picked up the Frosted Flakes and some... 
crunch berries the milk is in the refrigerator this is the bread I got the Hawaiian Kings Hawaiian uh, mini rolls this is what I'm gonna do for my sandwiches for the week I got Kevin some wipes y'all when I tell y'all Kevin is sensitive sensitive to everything it's ridiculous I told you he has real bad allergies so I also picked up so cloth medicine, my mom is feeling down and I don't want to get down to. Uh, also picked up some more deodorant. I picked up some dish soap. We were out. I picked up some foil. We were out of that. I also picked up this back and body. I already opened it as you can see. I took two of those in the car. Told y'all about my back. And then I just picked up two regular things of ibuprofen. I had these in the car. So I took these out. They were in the trunk for a while. I'm going to put some of these in my refrigerator and use those. And I also have a case of water that's on the stairs. So I'm going to get all of this put away. Today is wash day for my hair, but I don't know what's come over me. I'm just not in the mood. My chest feels heavy. Anyway, I'm going to use the new um, Voodoo Hair Growth Oil to moisturize my scalp. As well as this Sulfur 8. I'm still going to retwist with Pure Honey, the Cream of Nature, and then I'm simply just going to comb it out. So I don't know why I was under the impression for the Miracle Journal that it was more so like the 369 journal, meaning, you know, like you read a couple pages, it tells you about it, and then like you just get the script, and this is actually like building yourself which I still love about it, but I really just sat here and thought that I could get through this whole thing in a day. Not possible. Um, simply because I thought that it was more so like this, where you read the guide and then you start the 369 manifestation method. I'm really sitting here, like, thinking about exactly what I want my first manifestation method to be about. I have an idea. Just not too sure. I'm going to put these. I have been marinating my chicken for dinner. And I'm getting ready to lay those in the pan. chicken going I just read that I can manifest two things at one time now I'm working with something I was working with something anyway but I know what I'm gonna write and at least for the next 21 days this is what my key points will be about in my journal Okay, so I'm actually going to just start this tomorrow. I do want to jot down two ideas that I can play around with for what I want to manifest for the first time around. Um, just so my words can be right. I can ponder on it and then I can officially write it in my book starting tomorrow morning. It's already after 6, so there was no point of actually trying to start tonight after I thought about it because 369. We What was the point of writing it in there today? Um, I don't know. This seemed like the longest weekend ever. It is currently 6.51 and I still don't have my nails done. That's because I'm that person who, I like, I like every, well, not everything, but I like for my nails to match. And I still have the blue on my toes from last week, week before last, when I had those blue nails. So I still didn't put the new fresh tips on. I don't know. It's it's all coming together. I may or may not get it done tonight. If I don't, it's completely fine. I'm not going to beat myself up about it. Eat out. Tonight was eat out Sunday. We got Jason's Deli. So now that I've gotten everything else finished, I can go ahead and eat. I got the Club Royale. And I'm going to take some medicine and lay down because my chest still feels heavy. Hey, man. I got to celebrate a huge milestone. I got to do my TikTok haul and I got to show you Jackson rambunctiousness on the soccer field. Yeah. Say thanks for coming along with me this weekend and I'll see you again in the next one. Bye.